This is my friend Gracie. She's going to be a butterfly today. Um, and I'm going to use this rainbow cake and I have a three quarter inch, three quarter inch flat brush and it's, it's already wet. So I'm going to load it with all three of these colors. And now that I have a good load, Gracie, can you close your eyes really softly just like you're sleeping? Okay, I'm gonna lay the brush right here. Remember that our focal point is the corner of the eye and the corner of the forehead here. So I kinda of wanna make sure that my wings um, are that shape. So I'm gonna start up here close to the corner of her forehead and I'm gonna take the darkest color and kinda of turn the brush that direction so that, that that color lays on the outside. I'm just gonna to touch right here in the corner of her eye and just kinda of flick it up to meet it. And then I'm gonna lay it down up here and give it a little wiggle and then pull. Lay it down, wiggle, and pull. So her little face only has room for two like petal shapes for this butterfly. Some kids have a little more forehead, so I can get three. But Gracie's got a little sweet forehead, so we're gonna just do two. Now in the middle where it's bare, I'm gonna start in the corner. Keep your eyes closed real soft, baby. And I'm just gonna fill in that middle, and then I'm gonna lay it down and we'll get the inside of the of the wing. And the bottom wing, I like to be, just relax your face, baby girl. Don't squeeze tight. There you go, close your eyes real softly. And the little one, I want to be a little bit smaller, and my focal point's gonna be kinda like the bottom of her ear over here, so I'm gonna kinda, I really don't wanna take up a lot of her cheek down this direction, so I wanna go from the corner of her eye and keep the corner of her ear in mind with the shape. So I'm gonna lay it down, and again, I'm gonna twist the brush so that the dark color's on the outside. And then I'm gonna lay it down and give it a little wiggle. Lay it down and give it a little wiggle. And then in the middle, right underneath her eyelashes, I'm just gonna lay it down and bring it up to a little point. So we finished off our butterfly on this side. While this is wet, keep your eyes closed for me, sweet girl. While this is wet, I'm gonna spread a little bit of glitter on here because while I'm working on the other side, that's gonna dry and I want some glitter to stick. So I'm gonna reload my brush because I've been talking. So normally I don't have to reload my brush very often because I do this really fast. Okay, so turn your face this way for me, sweet. And I'm gonna do exactly the same thing. I'm gonna find the distance, the corner of her eye, the, the corner of her forehead, and I'm not gonna go quite up here. I don't want this to be all the way up here to her hair, but I'm gonna get kind of in between the two. Turn my brush so that my dark color's on the outside, then I'm gonna to touch your eye, baby girl. It's gonna go right on the corner of her eye just to kind of fill in the space. And I'm gonna lay down, wiggle and pull, lay down, wiggle and pull. And then in the middle of the eye, I'm gonna fill in with the bright color corner of the brush. And then I'm gonna lay down right here, lay down right here. If I don't feel like it's as bold as I want it to be, sometimes I'll go the opposite direction because I haven't already laid the paint off of that side of the brush. So I have a little more paint there. And then I'm gonna do the same thing on the bottom. Keep in mind the corner of the eye and the bottom of the ear. And that's kind of my space that I wanna fill. Lay it down and wiggle. There we go, keep your eyes closed for me while I do some glitter on this side. While that's wet. Okay, keep your eyes closed while that dries, baby girl. Can you turn your head this way just a little? There we go, just keep your eyes closed for me. And Usually, usually whenever I do a butterfly, I like to take the darkest color that's on the outside edge and I will use that for the body and the, um, and the antenna of our design. So this is the cake we used. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna pick up the purple on my round brush and right in the middle of her nose, right in between the eyes, I'm gonna lay the brush down, push, and then lift and flick up. So I have a nice wide teardrop at the front and a very thin point at the bottom. And then I'm gonna lay it down, and swirl up, lay it down and swirl up. There we go, there's our butterfly. Would you like to see Gracie? There's your butterfly, do you love it? Isn't it beautiful? Thank you for being